Hi and welcome back to Star Conflict Tutorials. Today we will pick 5 weapons that are best for PvP action. The main criteria in today's top 5 list is ease of use and tactical flexibility. Number 5 has all beam type weapons – pulse laser, ion emitter, beam cannon and the aptly named destructor. We feature all these weapons at number 5 because of their sheer flexibility. They deal very high damage against a single target, just keep your sight on the enemy and voila! Having a good gaming mouse will greatly increase your chances of success. Note that the pulse laser is meant for number 5 only if used with a curved reflector. This device reduces the effective range of your lasers but also increases their damage. Number 4 is the good old phaser, a unique weapon of command fighters. It combines an essentially weaker version of Gauss Cannon and the Singularity Cannon into one. This weapon is perfect for destroying any type of target, you can even reliably hit interceptors from afar, but don't forget to opt for alternate fire versus larger threats. The phaser can create huge and powerful explosions, but you will need to hit your alternate fire projectile with your primary fire mode. This is tricky and takes practice, so don't expect to be pulling that one off the first time you use this weapon. Number 3 is Frigate's favorite, the Coil Mortar. An effective and easy to use weapon, its main advantage is decent area of effect damage. Every shot from this gun creates a small blast that damages all in its range. So, you don't need to be extremely accurate with this weapon, you can just fire at any debris floating around your target to damage it. But you might run into some difficulty with interceptors though. If your enemy is too quick for your gun, wait for it to approach any other object in space, such as a building or an asteroid, and then fire away. Splash damage from the mortar is so powerful, it is most likely to completely destroy an interceptor in just a few blasts. Number 2 is a gun with a hard-to-pronounce name of Tharked. It was first introduced during the Evolution update. This weapon can be installed into any gunship fighter. But the true beauty of it is that it can deal with almost any threat out there. Its high damage output allows it to destroy some really large targets. While its high projectile speed lets you target interceptors with ease. Tarked is a space shotgun that can have its spread reduced and effective range increased in battle. To do it, just hold down the left mouse key and release it a bit later. This will narrow down the spread, making all the projectiles fly in a tighter pattern. Number 1 goes to the Eclipse Launcher, which can be installed only on engineering frigates. This weapon is a lot like the Coal Mortar since they both deal AoE damage and have similar projectile speed. Eclipse Launcher is a true jack-of-all-trades, which tactical applications can be rivaled only by the WL-13 emitter. But the latter can only be used with the Brock engine frigate, so we can't really feature it in this list. The emitter and the Eclipse can also restore hauls of friendly ships. Just fire at any stricken ally and you're all set. So, if your ally has been chased by a bothersome little interceptor, don't worry and take a shot. You're likely to treat the foe while repairing your friend. Sadly, we only have a room for 5 in this list, but there are a lot more great weapons in the game, so here are our special mentions for each specific ship class in the game that we thought deserved some time in the spotlight. The Tlilith Beam is extremely easy to use, but it suffers from low damage output and can only be ever truly effective versus weaker targets. A true classic, the Plasma Gun, can deal tremendous damage with certain ship builds, but you will have to be extra accurate when dealing with faster opponents. Finally, the Positron Cannon is perfect for sniper builds and quite good on guard frigates. It didn't make it into our top 5 proper because it has a much easier to use alternative, the Coil Mortar. Well, as to the weapons of Destroyer class ships, they don't make it on our list because of their limited tactical applications. Some are only good at range while others are limited to close combat only, but still. There are a bunch of really good ones among those as well. We highly recommend you try the Coil Gun for its ability to fire accurately at virtually any target in space. This is it for this episode. See you in space!